Hi, everybody. So I wanted to introduce you guys to our other two teachers that couldn't make it to the first video. So I'm really excited because both of these people are amazing, Sarah and Wendy. And they're going to talk about how they're going to help you in class. And also, they're both coaches. And I think I'm really excited about both of these classes. So I wanted to talk to you about them. And I want to get the name of the class right. So Sarah's going to go first. And the name of her class is Return to Your Own Nature. So go ahead, yeah. Sarah. Yeah, so I'm super excited and thank you, honey, for the offering this opportunity yeah. uh, for us to kind of share our medicine and for your audience to get connected more. So I think it's going to be great. So, yeah, what I, what this class really? So I've been on a journey for many, many years and really drawing a lot of my own um, experience and what I have been uncovering is kind of what I want to what I bring want to bring forward and. Um, I think we know a lot of people that have been on this journey for a while that it's not really about becoming someone it's about unbecoming all the things that we picked up along the way and that really that is where our true essence and our true nature nature lies and um, what I tend to attract just kind of the people that have been on this journey for a while and really have a certain level of awareness you have awareness of that you know, your, your, your mindset is important and you might have gone down the road of, you know, affirmations and visualizations and the importance of that kind of positive outlook. And at some point we kind of, after that, we get dive into the shadow aspect and we realize, okay, I actually have these uh, limiting beliefs. I have trauma responses and how I act and respond to things. And I don't really have these traits that I kind of feel yucky about. And I, kind of hate these parts about myself and just those kinds of aspects. And then a certain point, and this is where that return to our essence and our nature in the name of this class is where we kind of need to put down all the things that we've learned along the way, because it's now almost become a new addiction, a new crutch, a new way that we're always constantly fixing and searching. There's more we need to do and there's more work and just feeling like we're never fully arriving. and this class will kind of dive deeper into how we can kind of um, step into that essence and what's required in that and the steps and the processes kind of around that. And particularly for me, it has been a, a strong connection to nature. So it's a bit of a play on words uh, and how we can connect to nature in helping us to return to our own nature. Wonderful, wonderful, I love that. And then Wendy is going to be doing the body mind connection. Oh, there she, there she is. Okay. Yeah. So Wendy's going to do the body mind connection. So tell yes. us about that. So thank you all for being here. I'm Wendy and um, I've known Honey for many, many years. And um, I'm super excited because I want y'all to know that this is a dream that I've known about of hers for a very long time to create this school. So I'm really honored to be a part of this school. So thank you, honey. I, I call honey, honey Kara. So I have to pause there. Anyway, I'm here because this is really a journey, right? Like we all are wanting just to feel well in this one lifetime that we have here on earth. And so for me, wellness has been like this passion of mine. Um, I started in the mental wellness field, mental health field, and, um, you know, learning about a lot of the struggles that people have, a lot of which Sarah referred to, you know, as a lot of history and past things that we sort of drag along with us. And then I moved into um, nursing. I've been a nurse for 20 years and learning about the body and physiology and how the body works. And um, what really sort of light bulbed for me in the last several years is the concept that like they are so deeply intertwined and connected that if you not, are not really addressing both aspects of your being all the time, your, your mind and your body, um, it's hard to be in balance and find harmony. And so um, for me, again, the, the goal is to achieve vitality and joy, right? Like we want to feel good in our body. And something that has recently um, sparked for me is that uh, your biology really drives your psychology. And so there's a lot of things that we can do to help 
really create some balance to decrease, decrease stress, decrease fatigue, um, things that then also affect our mood and our energy level. And so in this class, I really want to just start at the basics, really like, you know, um, what are the things, what are the lifestyle choices? What are some natural remedies that we can utilize to find a little bit more of that common ground for our body so that um, there is that we can find the optimal body mind connection and we can feel good in our bodies and be in a good place mentally and ultimately live a long, healthy life. So it's about, you know, um, physical health, mental wellness, and longevity and putting all those together. So that's what I hope to give some insight around in my class. I love that. Yeah. All of it's so important and whatever speaks to you, like as the audience, like whatever speaks to you, whatever you need, that's the class that you want to take. You may want to take them all, but, and they will be spaced out during the day. So you can do that. But I just wanted to, you know, I'm going to put these two links below and at the top so you guys can see them and go ahead and sign up if this moves you to do so. Because I think what we're doing right now is we're all in it to help each other. And that's what this school is about is to help ourselves and to help you so that we can all learn new things and create a new world. So. That's basically, that's yeah. the plan. <laughs> yeah, and I'd also want to say the way I, I'm structuring my class is going to be uh, about the first part, a bit of bit teaching, lecturing, if you will, but also I'm hoping to have it kind of interactive. If someone has something that they would like some coaching on, that we can kind of work on that in a dis or a discussion, questions, that kind of thing, but uh, plenty of time, more than five minutes at the end, but a, a good chunk of it to yeah. kind of be interesting. So yeah. I just wanted to add that. I forgot to say that. Agreed. Are you you doing that as well, Wendy? Yes. Okay. Yes, absolutely. I definitely would yeah. like to not just speak at you. I'd love for it to be interactive and um, and then it, you know, it helps us as teachers to know like what what do people need? What are people seeking? So I want to definitely, in a, in a sense, have a uh, survey, an opportunity to kind of survey the people that come mm -hmm. so that I can serve you best. So yeah. Yeah. That's great. And then the classes, we are recording them. So you'll have two days after the class to actually watch the class as well. So if you forgot to take notes or if you didn't, weren't able to attend the live class, then you can still watch the class and everybody will still be allowed to send in one question. If they couldn't, you know, attend the live class, then you can still send a question to your teacher and find out like what the answer is for you. So I just wanted to let everybody know that. And thank you all for watching. Have a beautiful day. Uh -huh.